Orlando Pride stunned Chicago Red Stars in a 5-2 win, photo, Orlando Pride Chicago Red Stars Orlando Pride Chicago Red Stars, Nair, Camo, Naughton, Johnson, Gilliland, Colaprico, Gordon, Min 46, Ertz, Huerta, White, Min. 65, Nagasato, Vasconcelos, Mots, Min, 46, Kerr Orlando Pride, Harris, Krieger, Pickett, Min, 71, Monica, Sidorsky, Poliana, Weatherholt, Van Egmond, Kennedy, Hill, Morgan, Marta, LaRue, Min. 52, score, 0 to 1, Min. 2, Hill, 0 to 2, Min, 6, Morgan, 1 to 2, Min, 21, Carr, 2 to 2, Min. 60, Carr, 2-3, Min, 61, LaRue, 2-4, Min 63, LaRue, 2-5, Min, 83, Weatherholt. Referee, Yellow Card, Sam Johnson Min. 42 The Lifetime Game of the Week was one for the books. The Orlando Pride visited Chicago for the second time this season and were able to stun the Chicago Red Stars for the second time for this season. Orlando left no time to get on the board. The Pride were the first to get on the board in just the second minute of the match. Poliana sent a ball straight into the box and Rachel Hill gets right onto the ball and gives Orlando the lead. Just four minutes later, Marta came running down the side doing what she does best. She sent a cross into the box that went straight to the head of Alex Morgan who doubled the lead for Orlando. Alyssa Nair made some huge saves in today's game. Photo, Chicago Red Stars. It took a while for Chicago to get into the match as Orlando continued to get more chances but finally the reigning NWSL MVP and Golden Boot winner got her first of the match. Sam Kerr got loose and went 1v1 against Orlando goalkeeper, Ashlyn Harris. Harris was able to make the initial save but the ball stayed in play. Yuki Nagasato was finally able to get on the end of the ball and send the ball right back to Kerr who got headed in and got Chicago on the board. Both teams got some chances on goal towards the end of the half but neither teams were able to convert another before the whistle blew. LaRue comes off the bench and holds nothing back. The second half was underway and both teams got their fair share of chances. Neither team was able to covert at first but then the fun started in the 60th minute. Nagasato got on yet another ball and slipped it past the Orlando defense and to the feet of Carr. Kerr scored her second of the match to tie the game. Orlando waited for nothing to take back their lead and Sydney LaRue came on in the 52nd minute and made her presence known as soon as possible. Just one minute after Kerr's goal, Ali Krieger sent a brilliant ball into the box. LaRue beat the defense and got her head to the ball to take back the lead. Then just two minutes LaRue got on yet another ball from a miss clearance from the Chicago defense to double Orlando's lead. Sydney LaRue scored her first two goals in purple today. Photo, Orlando Pride Chicago tried to get back into the game but the Pride weren't going to allow this happen. The defense kept a close eye on Kerr and made sure she wasn't able to get past them to earn a hat-trick. Harris made key saves that denied the Red Stars getting back into it and Donnie Weatherholt scored her first goal of the season to seal the deal and finish the game in the 83rd minute. Chicago will look to shake that game off and get back into their winning ways against the Washington Spirit in next week's Lifetime Game of the Week. Whereas Orlando will look to continue with the momentum they have against Seattle Rain FC on Sunday, June 3rd. More news about